Cedar Key, Florida. Uh, yeah, what's well, the story behind this? There it is. Right in the, we want to be in the crook of the armpit of Florida. It basically shaved off a couple of days off no, of Cedar Key. Quite the armpit. Yeah, but we shaved off a couple of days uh, from uh, the we Panama City. We rearranged our yeah. schedule. So anyway, our schedule. We only had like three days out at Cedar Key, so, so we could go to Disney. There wasn't wasn't a lot, which you already saw. Yeah, uh, Sunset Isle. There it is. Uh, okay, I wait. Hold, look, I, they was, went, I come, was a bit skeptical. Right, they went of Cedar Key. Yeah. Go ahead. Well, okay. Anyway, they went, yeah, condo, <laughs> like everything else. You're skeptical as in what? There's our spot. Keep talking. I was skeptical because, you know, I thought, you know, Cedar Key, what the hell? Never heard of it. Right. You know, it's it's out in the middle of nowhere. Right. Well, it is. And I did not want to leave this place. Really? Oh, my God. <laughs> they, Look what they it had, did to him. <laughs> they had good malt liquor out yeah, there. He hey, started the, swirling yeah, like the... <laughs> that local piss that they call beer. Well, that's what it is. Anyway, but yeah, no, it's it's stinking beautiful. Piss. It's you know you got all these like wonderful little docks. It like, apparently... is so picturesque you can right. puke. Yeah, and apparently what they're a big clamor. It's a big thing. It's, they, clams is a big Little thing. Clams, Little yeah. night clams. Yep, much different from New England clams that we're used to. Uh, very friendly pelicans. Right up in your face. Yeah, this is the downtown. Is. That hasn't changed from the 30s from or the 20s, perhaps. Yep. Right. It's beautiful. I mean, it, yep. it's, it's you know, there's cedars there. That's why it's called Cedar, cedar Key. Cedar Key. And most yep. of the architecture, all the original stuff, you can see on right. these, these buildings here, like this right. one, it's all the weathered cedar. Right. It's that, really That's an beautiful. art store. They and tin roofs. Right. They all have tin the roofs. Rusted. Rusted. Uh, they had... Here's a bird with breasts on it. Yeah, anyway, that was interesting. Uh, See, and the I, beach. I went into an art gallery right. for culture. <laughs> yes. And uh, ben, we're out of the what beach did now. you look at? Yeah. Right, the breasts. Whoops. Oh, boy. Uh, by the way, yeah the, yeah, the water is basically brown. Yeah, it's not it's, exactly... It's very um, yeah, it's, silty. It's, yeah, and apparently it's very, it's very shallow out there. You go out 10 miles, allegedly, yeah, to get 10 feet. Yeah, some guy told us, yeah. That, but that was the same story we yeah. heard at Lake Okeechobee, so... Yeah, this, this is This from, is the park. The, this is the state park right. from, from heaven. Right. Heaven. Pine cones. Lay under the glass. Pine these cones. These things are right. as big as hand grenades, yep. these pine cones. <laughs> Grenade. And right, the big industry was back in the One 1800s. One of the big industries. Salt. Salt. Right. This was huge. This, yeah. You, this, the two of us could fit in and take and a bath in. Dan was a big confederate, or, or the Union Army came down here to prevent the South from making salt. But it was a whole yep. big story. They used to yeah. fill that with seawater right. and boil it off to get the salt. Some of the local creatures. Yeah, isn't that cool? I mean, well, it would have been cool. <laughs> a, it was cool when it was one. alive. It's a dead <laughs> one. That way. Yep. <laughs> I've never seen an armadillo. Art cars. This, this is the best this one. This is fantastic. This is the most awesome art Beats, car yep. I've ever seen. Beats anything in Key West. There you go. I mean, not only is it decorated with crap, but right. it's designed with <laughs> right, right. decorations. I loved it. I loved it. It was like the it. girls' cars. It was the purse club car. Anyway, if you notice, all the little thingies were, were right, girly stuff. Pork rinds. These are some damn giant pork rinds. These are pork jumbo rinds. These pork were rinds. pulled right off the cow somehow and these thrown into the fat. These were from cow-sized pigs. All right. I like to talk about the derogatory term cracker, cracker. now. Now, uh, here. Here's a white guy, right? Now. Is that what well, that is? Exactly, yeah. <laughs> no, cracker. I, I was never offended by the term, you know, because it's like, well, I mean, what's association? What, do we look like crackers? Do we, are we light in color? I mean, I don't, I, I don't know. Are we salty? I don't get it. Uh, are we, no, my, well, think right, salty. yeah, you know, and, <laughs> yes. Now, why don't they, why don't like other minorities call us like Wonder Bread or something, or even Cool Whip? I don't go, I don't understand. But we found out the real answer, which is... Ta-da! Ta <laughs> it comes back from the days when Florida was uh, way back, you know, Lots of cattle in, in our history. Right. When the cattle drovers went through, they had men who, you know... Cracked the whip. Cracked the whip right. to get the cattle moving, and they were called crackers. crackers right. And thus, it's it now and they were attributed kind, to... You know, they, they were kind of people who weren't too smart. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> They're not right. Yeah, they weren't suited for much of anything except right. cracking a whip at a bunch of cattle. Yeah, so it's now <laughs> See, attributed you know, to people who weren't too particularly right. socially astute, or you know, right. And it's because now it's associated yeah. with anybody in Florida, like the southern. No, not, not anybody. Now it's it's well, a, so it's a become a derogatory term to refer to people who are hicks, rednecks. From, Right. Particularly those who live in north central Florida and right. the panhandle in right, particular. Right. And basically also 
a style of architecture, right. which is like it's a one room house with a tin roof, basically. Which is a cracker house, I guess. Cracker right? house. It's raised right. up off the ground and yeah. Then Rosewood. Th- then some fat guy with a cigar uh, at the laundromat. To be a historian. Right. Told yeah. us about Rosewood. Right here. Give him the story in Rosewood. Rosewood. Okay. Well, this was this is Cedar Key's shameful yes. secret. Right, and here's basically Route what twenty four that it takes you yep. to Rosewood. Twenty four to, to basically yeah, Cedar Key, middle of nowhere, and that's where it is. The Gulf. Okay, Rosewood was a settlement comprised mostly of of prosperous black families, and uh, a white woman from Cedar Key, some local cracker slut, no doubt. <laughs> yeah, a clue, <laughs> accused a black young black man. Of raping her. Right. And, and then, you know that's all it takes. <laughs> to set them off, right? Them good old white boys down <laughs> right. there are only looking for an excuse. Right. They burned the to town. Go beaten up and otherwise. Yep. Apparently, well, they burned the town, they, killed yeah, everybody. No, it was pretty awful. They, yeah. They burnt the whole town. Right. They, um, a lot of people, you know, just fled into the woods right. to hide for their lives, but they, they burned some people yep. alive. They tortured them. They hung them. And there's a little monument here, you know, a little plaque we saw and on the side of the road. It's not something that Cedar Key wants you to really know about. Right. And, of course, oh, this, they made a ha- movie yeah, out of it, this too. this happened in the 20s, by <laughs> yeah. the way. Then we decided to leave for Cedar Key. We were driving all the way through the Panhandle. We came upon this place, uh, which is a gas station, which I found this fascinating. <laughs> like, Canadian look at all these store. pepper this sauces. Awesome. Right. Right. Uh, you got you got such things as Psycho, psycho Bitch, bitch from hell. right? <laughs> uh, bad Dad, sorry, Bad Day at Baghdad, uh, Pepper, Pleasure and Pain, and this is my favorite, show show us your tits, tits hot, hot sauce, sauce right? Sir, fart a right. lot, yep. hot sauce. Yep. I and, would have loved to have bought in, lizards, every one of those bottles. Right. And liver, livers and gizzards were also on the menu. Fried. <laughs> uh, this Deep is fried. interesting. Also on the way down here, uh, flush gas yeah. homes. What new use and repos? I want yeah, to read the right. small print. <laughs> right. what, what family would come home with? Damn! I know we should have made the last payment. Damn! They took our house. Don't <laughs> oh, me one of them repo <laughs> houses, Paul. Uh, oh yeah, and Especially they get, we passed over. House. And then we passed over. <laughs> way down upon this one. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> I'm doing the banjo. Yeah. Right. And basically, this is the last shot. This is what oh, it looks like. The whole world is sad and dreary. So next this stop one's for we'll you, Panama Gary, City. because I know you love my singing. <laughs> and Nick, too. You know, I'll throw you a bone. Everywhere I roam. Yes. The end. Oh, Gary, and no how singing. my heart and grows no weary, singing. far from the old folks at home. <laughs> Okay, (laughs) I'm done.